Okay, I... Oh my fucking god. Okay, guys, I know I've been, like, gone for so fucking long, but I love vlogging. I love making videos on here, but I've just been so fucking busy lately, and I'm still so busy, but the busyness is gonna die down. So it's Monday. This is my work shirt. Oh my fucking god. Nobody stalked me. Fuck. Okay, I'm getting ready for work. I have to leave, like, so soon, but I have, like, so much fucking, like, weird shit that's happened. So last night at 3 in the morning, an unknown number fucking texted me, hi. Just hi. I'm going to work today, and every day I've gone to work on my new job, I have worn makeup, but today I don't want to wear makeup. But the thing is, I have this thing, like, if I wear makeup around people, if they've only seen me in makeup, then it makes me nervous to not wear makeup around them. Even if I, I like the way I actually look better a lot more with, like, less makeup. But it just makes me so nervous for some reason, and I don't know why. But yeah, I'm just gonna do your mom. I feel like I really have the humor of like a middle schooler, but whatever. Okay, I'm ready and everything. I'm about to go. I did like put on makeup, but when I say like I don't want to wear that much makeup, I really just mean foundation. Like I love other makeup. Other makeup is my favorite thing ever. Also, my new signature scent is vanilla, so. Oh my god. So I'm outside right now because I just broke up with my boyfriend. Uh, I just got home from work too. Um, yeah. It's just weird. I don't even like have anything to say right now. I'm just like speechless about everything. And that's just how I am right now. I wanna go take a nap, but I'm outside. I just want to, I just want to take a nap. I literally never take naps, but I want to take one right now. I'm outside because we live together. It is in my room right now because it's also his room. <laughs> and I don't want to be in my, around him right now. It's like, we're not even like, I'm not like mad at, we're not mad at each other. I just, it's just like, I don't even like, it's like one of those times where you break up with someone, even though like, it's like, I still like have like feelings and like for him, but it's still, like just what I had to do. So I will tell you guys more. Okay, it's Tuesday. Um, I'm at work. I'm working a fucking double 10 hour shift today. <sighs> I'm on my second shift of it, though. I don't know why I said that so, like, weirdly. Anyways, I'm fucking suffering because literally I keep fucking, like, trying not to cry so hard at work because I'm sad because me and my boyfriend broke up yesterday and it literally like he literally just does not care at all and it's like oh my fucking god i thought like this would mean more to you but it doesn't and it's just like oh wow so i'm the only one in pain here we should be suffering together like come on start suffering come on let's let's get to it but i'm joking i obviously don't want him to suffer but it's just like look at her him to suffer it's just like why aren't you though like why aren't you so yeah i literally keep almost crying to the point where my fucking nostrils are fucking burning it's so annoying i'll see you later Okay, so I'm literally just fucking around doing shit I shouldn't be right now, but I went to the other side of where I work because it's a froyo place and I got this super good stuff and I'm gonna mix up like a smoothie because right now my job is to make milkshakes, but I'm just making like something better. And then I got little boba pearls. Okay, I have to go take this person's order. I tried.
Okay, it's like one in the morning now. I'm going to bed. Okay, good morning. I'm at work again. I literally have a fucking rash on my arm. I don't know where it came from. Um, I have another double today, so I'm literally here for 10 hours again. And that's all I really plan on doing. I don't think I'm gonna film. I don't know how much I'm gonna film today. I just wanna say good morning. It's literally so fucking itchy. Look at this shit. I'm Okay, it's like 11 fucking p.m. I didn't even realize how long it was. I went to the mall. I had no idea how long I was there. But I was shopping. I didn't even get that much stuff. I didn't even get that much stuff. But I'm going to show you what I got. Wow. I literally just feel so awkward right now. Oh my god, I forgot I got mints. Oh my fuck. I forgot I got mints. <laughs> and I'm so happy about that. I went to this store called Not. I've never been there before. I bought some stuff. And I saw they had mints and I got them. I really want to try the peach ones. And I didn't mean to bite it. I got some shorts. Literally. Oh my god. And I got these pants. I saw them, and I kept looking at them every time I went to the mall. I literally have no idea what the fuck I'm gonna wear them with. I got this shirt. Oh my god, it's so fucking cute. Except for my nipples pop right out. I mean, not actually, but like, one wrong move, you know? And whoa. <laughs> but it's so cute. I fucking love the colors. Color scheme. The colors. I love it. I love it so much. Then I got, I got this shirt. I don't know what it was. I was like literally leaving the store and then I was like, oh my god, wait, I like that. And I just got it. And yeah, I don't know. I I don't know. I feel like I I don't know. It was just a very impulsive purchase. I got some of those fucking nibble covers for the shirt and I've never worn them before and I'm like so nervous. I don't know if they work it or not. And I'm just nervous as fuck. <laughs> and then oh my god. I got these like little shorts and like top set from Forever 21. It's so fucking cute. I literally, I love it so much. I just, I love it so fucking much. <laughs> I literally just like that's everything that I got but anyways literally I just keep saying literally but I've just been so tired today like I don't know what it is I just woke up and I was like really tired and I've just been pretty tired today and I still just feel like so tired today wait one more thing I do want to say the shorts and the pants I got from cotton on they're very form-fitting in a good way. And I always have, like, a hard time finding stuff that fits me in. So, like, I just had to let you guys know. <laughs> it's, like, a struggle. Like, for real. I'm gonna show. I'm gonna take like a interior design quiz to see which one fits my fucking style. And I'm literally going to furniture my apartment based on this. I mean like if I feel like it fits, you know, obviously if I feel like it's like completely wrong and it's something that I hate, obviously, obviously I'm not gonna fucking do it. I got mid-century modern and that's not surprising because I, looked up what the fuck mid-century modern is because i had no idea what the fuck it was and it looks like everything that i've gotten for my apartment already so in the 
mornings, I've been finding myself really just liking to sit outside for a little bit, like, sometimes even, like, a fucking hour, and just, like, think about, like, just, like, prepare myself for the day, I guess, and just, like, think about everything I want to accomplish for the day, set my goals, and think about what I feel like is important to me today. Also, I have so many bug bites all over my body because there's so many mosquitoes outside where I live. And it's horrible, like horrible. I don't know what it is, but I feel like having woe as a catchphrase needs to just be something that I have in my life. I just need to say woe. Woe. God. I'm trying to make food and I have this hair mask. Oily. I just realized I would've been so happy for a relationship to be over, guys. Cause like, not to like, I just feel like I'm a little bit too happy. <laughs> because it's like, I just realized how fucking like, I was just being so stupid. Like, oh my fucking God. <laughs> oh my God. I can't even like believe it. I'm like, like literally I like blacked out oh my fucking god like what the fuck i just came back to reality like what the fuck oh my god what the fuck <laughs> but i have to go run some errands i don't even know if i fucking said that already i'm just trying to get ready i'm just in a hair mask first and then i'm going in the shower and getting ready but i still don't know what to eat I just got out of the shower. I put on some of the clothes I got yesterday. I love my outfit so much. I just like, it's just so cute. Like literally, I just love it. So I'm back outside, just outside. I did all of my makeup. I got dressed and I changed my mind. I literally don't want to go anywhere at all today. I just feel so fucking tired. Like yesterday I was so tired and I just feel so tired today. And I just want to take a nap, honestly, but I'm not gonna take a nap. Oh, I still kind of wanted to go and get food, though. I think I should. Because, like, honestly, you know, I just, you know, I don't feel like cooking anything at all. So, you know. Just look at my makeup. Okay, look at it. It literally, it matches my shirt. The sparkle colors. I'm so in love. My dog just came here and he scared the shit out of me. Okay, so I went to the store. Okay, my fucking god. Obviously, I went to the store. Jesus, fuck. I'm showing you guys about the store. Oh my god. I'm getting sushi. Fuck. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, oh my god. Okay, I'm finally back from the store. Also, I love my makeup so much. I've said that probably so many times, but I love it. I got this drink. I don't know why, but I'm so obsessed with, like, aloe drinks. They're the best thing ever. I got some sushi. I got my most literally favorite ice cream ever. It's caramel macchiato. Oh, my God. It's so fucking good. But I don't have one with me right now, so I can't show you. But literally, oh, my God. It's the best thing in the world. And I also made some ramen. I put, like, an egg in it and some vegetables. So... It's going to be very fucking good. But first, we have to talk. We have to talk. Like, literally, we need to talk. I literally, like I was saying earlier, oh my god, I literally just fucking like hit myself in my chest on accident. Holy fuck. I have never been so happy to be out of a relationship because it's like literally like the glasses, all that shit is coming off. My eyes. Like, I don't know if them, okay, like the red colored glasses, the rose colored glasses, oh my god. I don't know how to like talk right. They're coming off and like literally, I just realized I've been so held back from like being myself. And I'm just so fucking happy because like, I literally feel like I haven't been myself for so long. And I feel like I was like letting things slide that I shouldn't have been letting like slide at all. And I feel like.
so sad that I did that to myself, but I'm just so happy at the same time that, like, I'm done with that situation. It's so, anyways, the point of this, if you're in a fucking relationship with some guy and he's not literally, they, like, <sighs> fucking praising the ground you walk on, if he's not in love with you, if he's making, like, you feel bad and shit, like, literally just leave him. Just leave him. No. It's literally just, like, be selfish. Just be selfish. With yourself, your time, your love, your energy. Be selfish with it. Be- Fuck. Be selfish with- so <laughs> Okay. Literally, I cannot get what I'm trying to say across. But you'll probably get it. Just please never make excuses for somebody else. Don't let them continue making it. You deserve everything and more. Always, no matter what.